as you can see here as well it just shows how short you can have the natural hair just going towards the top there and it can still blend seamlessly with a hair system yes guys welcome back to hair system diy a nice quick video for you today where i'm going to be looking at some of in my opinion what the best haircuts for hair systems now this is very contemporary to may 2024 and my views are always changing and evolving it's a very sort of fluid mix however these are three particular haircuts slash hairstyles which i think really work with hair systems at the moment one of them is actually quite similar to the actual hairstyle that i've got at the moment and i just really like it so i'm going to be showing you three videos there will be no music or sound on these videos because when i do that youtube gets really angry and i get these copyright violations and stuff like that so i'm going to have some stock music playing in the background it won't quite be the same but hopefully it will suffice i'd be really interested to hear your guys feedback as well any styles that you like it does need to be compatible with a hair system so i'm not talking like super fine buzz cut or anything like that I'd be really interested to hear your guys opinions and views and that kind of thing so this first one is with Toupee Queen. I shared actually one of her, I did like a little green screen collab thing on YouTube Shorts not too long ago with her doing one of her systems. She is really good. I think she's based in Salt Lake City or something, but her videos are really good. Quite entertaining sometimes as well. But this gentleman, he looks like he's probably in his 40s, but what she starts with is a really nice skin fade there. And that's to effectively blend with the hair system or toupee, as she likes to call them when it's actually going on. So as you can see, he's already got a nice fade. It's also quite short. As you can see, the bio hair at the top is quite short. It doesn't have to be two inches long or anything like that. And this video absolutely proves that. I think my hair, my bio hair at the top now is probably about half an inch. That's how short my barber actually cut it and it, it looks fine. So here goes the system, it goes on front to back, and now she's gonna sort of start blending it. Uh, she tends to use a razor where she sort of blends it and then gives it a bit of body with the blow dryer, and it just looks fantastic. It, it blends perfectly well, and it just like looks like a really sort of cool, trendy haircut. Low maintenance, not much work needs doing on that. If you just, you know, use a silk pillow or something, it would take 30 seconds to get back to that look pretty much every morning. And look, he looks very happy, doesn't he? But it looks great. You know, blend is fantastic. As you can see here as well, it just shows how short you can have the natural hair just going towards the top there. And it can still blend seamlessly with a hair system. I'd imagine that the hair on top is maybe... 1.5 inches, something like that. So this next hair system is with a company called One Head Hair Solutions. I can't say I've heard of them before, but he begins by uh, shaving the sort of boarding areas and putting a bit of glue on. What's really interesting here as well, as you can see, it's really, really short at the top. It doesn't have to be long at the top where the natural hair ends. It doesn't have to be two inches or three inches or anything like that. It can be quite short. I'd say that's probably in sort of clippers terms. I'd say that's maybe like a three at maximum a four. He might go for a fade on this in a bit. I'm not too sure because I watched this yesterday. Here goes the system. It looks like it's a lace that's being attached with some highlights in it. What's really interesting here is there's probably a, yeah, there's a slight fade there, but it seems to work. His hair's still quite long, but it seems to work quite well. And that's what I quite like about it. I, especially in my earlier days of wearing systems, and I, I do still quite like this, is a sort of slicked back look. It works very well with a lace. I wouldn't necessarily recommend it with a poly just because the hairline is just not as realistic with a poly and it might get spotted. With a lace, you can get away with it. Is it higher maintenance on a day-to-day -day basis? Yes, because you have to make sure that the front of the lace is sticking down because if it's not, you're going to have lifts and people are going to spot it and it probably does require more time applying glue than you would if your hair was down. 
but it looks cool. I, I really like the look of that. The slick back look, the body is good. The hair's quite short on the sides. As you guys who have been following me for a while, you'll know I do like short sides. Primarily the reason for that is because of the hair pulling condition that I have. I do still have that. If the hair gets too long, my actual hair on the sides, you can even see there that there is thinning just from pulling it out for years and years. But also, you know, having short sides is pretty in at the moment. Quite a lot of people with hair systems do have short sides. But yeah, it blends nicely. I really like that. Really like it. Looks pretty realistic. Nice quiff at the front. Really short, as I mentioned earlier. Up here, it's super short. And it blends pretty well. It blends pretty well. And then the last one is the reason... I like this one is because of how realistic it looks now with gentlemen in their 50s or their 60s in my opinion it's harder to get the most realistic interpretation that's probably the wrong word to get the most realistic appearance with a hair system because your hair naturally thins at that age it also tends to go gray or white but what I really like about this it's short it blends really well with the natural hair on the sides, but it's also really, really realistic. I mean, if I was in my 50s or 60s, this is the kind of thing that I'd be going for, this style. Short, I'd want the greys and the whites to be matching my natural greys and whites on the side, but also I'd want it to look pretty realistic at the front. So this is them taking off the old one, applying the glue, and then putting it, it looks like, it actually looks like a poly. It could well be a poly. But you can see there, it looks really good. It's short as well, and it blends pretty much perfectly with his hair on the side. It's a really impressive finish. And, you know, if you can get that kind of finish with the right kind of density to match the natural recession, which happens to your hair at that kind of age, you're in a good spot. So those are three haircuts which I really like with hair systems. Why do I like them so much? Well, primarily because it blends so seamlessly with the natural hair that's on the sides. You want it to be as realistic as possible. And these, in my opinion, do look really realistic. The first one is probably my favourite because it's quite a sort of contemporary style. It's quite popular with people in my age and a lot of you guys. I know a lot of you guys are in your 20s, 30s and early 40s. You know, having a quiff at the front, you know, having it maybe a little bit messy on top, having short sides, quite often having a skin fade. I'm really into my skin fades. I have been for a while. The third one I like because that is what, that's the kind of style that I'd like to have when I'm in my 50s or 60s. Low maintenance, great blend with the sides, but also really realistic. So in terms of the density, the density is appropriate for the age bracket is so, so important. But guys, let me know what your favorite hairstyles are. What would your favorite haircuts be for a hair system? Let me know in the comments box below. Let's get a discussion going. I'd love to hear some feedback. Of course, different strokes for different folks. It's always great to hear different people's opinions, different styles. And heck, maybe you might say a style and I'll be like, hey, that sounds absolutely fantastic. Maybe I'll try that out on my next system. If you're enjoying my content and you are new around here, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up. Help the channel grow. Help other people find this free information. And maybe, you know what? Just maybe you might have helped start them on their journey to hair systems and toupees. Now, for those of you who have stuck around till the end, there's a video popping up on the screen right now, which looks at some really cool short hair system styles as well, seeing how short it can go. So do check that out. Let me know what you think of that as well. And I'll speak to you very soon. Bye for now.